start brushing a few of them away start from the edges. These off the top, at least. Around the edges are most important. Try to get them away. Just give them a little swish. There we go. Just like that. Yep. A little swish. Try to hurt them in. In or out, you don't have to stay. Yeah, they don't really care. They'll find their way back in, but anything that's along the edges like this, along the corners, they're going to get squished, and we're trying to avoid that because that puts out fear pheromones in the bees, and that's the last thing we really want. But the notch goes towards the front. And if you put it down gently enough, it gives the bees some time to get out of the way. Now we got the notch towards the front there, that's good. We put this together so quickly we didn't have time to paint it because this is sort of a surprise swarm. So I'm just going to gently lean this top cover on to give them a little gap in the front so that they can have some ventilation because it's plenty warm outside. Yeah, we're going to need to put a piece of wood or something underneath there. Our brick. A brick is fine. There's also a piece of uh, a cotton ball soaked in lemongrass oil in the bottom, which is hopefully going to keep them a little calmer and keep it smelling like home. Gives them a little extra air in there. Push that in so it doesn't draw moisture in. There we go. And it's about as good as it's going to get. Got a lot of bees in the outside still. So. Yep, well they should move their way in once they figure out this is a good home, so that's our demonstration about how to move a swarm. <laughs>